let's look at reference angles. For example, let's find the reference angle for theta equal 5 pi divided by 6. Now the reference angle is the acute positive angle formed by the terminal side of theta and the x-axis. So looking here, 5 pi over 6 is here. And then this here is the reference angle. It's the acute angle formed by the terminal side of theta and the x-axis. So what is this acute angle? Well, this angle here measures pi radians. And we can think of pi as 6 pi divided by 6, which means our angle 5 pi over 6 is pi over 6 units short of pi. So our reference angle is equal to pi minus 5 pi over 6 or 6 pi over 6 minus 5 pi over 6 which is pi divided by 6. Therefore, the measure of this angle then, or a reference angle, is pi divided by 6. All right, let's look at another example. Let's find the reference angle for theta equal to negative 156 degrees. Well, here is negative 156 degrees, and this angle here is the reference angle, or the acute angle, formed from the terminal side of the angle and the x-axis. Now this angle here measures negative 180 degrees. So negative 156 degrees didn't quite reach negative 180 degrees. So how much was it short? Well, since 180 minus 156 is equal to 24 degrees, then this reference angle is this positive acute measure here, which would be our answer. All right, let's look at one more. Let's find the reference angle for theta equal to 17 pi divided by 9. So here is 17 pi divided by 9. That is, it's almost one complete revolution. And remember, the radian measure of one complete revolution is 2 pi radians. Or thinking of that in terms of ninths, it's 18 pi divided by 9, isn't it? So 17 pi divided by 9 is one ninth short of one complete revolution. That is, this reference angle here we're looking for then is pi divided by 9. Because 2 pi minus 17 pi divided by 9 is equal to 18 pi divided by 9 minus 17 pi divided by 9 which is pi divided by 9. So the reference angle then is simply the acute angle formed by the terminal side of theta and the x-axis. Thank you, and we'll see you next time.